book reading session in this session we are to deal with thinking about language thinking about language let us participate in it positively here are 30 adjectives describing human qualities discuss them with your partner and put them in the two word waves according to whether you think they show positive or negative qualities you can consult a dictionary if you are not aware of the meanings of some of the words you may also add to the least the positive or negative pair of a given word you have given word kind sarcastic courteous arrogant insipid timid placid cruel haughty proud jealous intrepid sensitive compassionate introverted stolid cheerful contented thoughtless vain friendly unfor unforgiving fashionable generous talented lonely determined creative miserable and complacent for your sake of simplicity i have arranged it and mentioned their concerning meanings too. Positive. This wave involves positive sense of given words. As for example, courteous means vinamra. Placid means swamya. Intrepid means nidar. Sensitive means samvedanshil. Compassionate means karunamaya. Cheerful means has, hasmuk. Contented means santusht. Friendly means mitravat. Fashionable means sokin mijaj. Generous means udar. Talented means pratibhavan. Determined means dhrid nishche. Creative means rachanatmak. And jealous means utsai. This is all about uh, the positive words belonging to this given wave. Now come to next wave showing negative aspects of the words given in your book. As for example, there is a word stolid. In negative sense, <laughs> it is used as aveghin. In Hindi, it means aveghin or isthir. That means the place where you need to be. It becomes uh, negative when um, there is need to be in good velocity or acceleration, but you are in a quite a static mode, then is stolid. And in Hindi, it means aveghin. Introverted, Antarmukhi, Ya Antarvart, Ya Antshari. Haughty, means Ghamandi, Ya Avimani, Ya Akarvaj. Cruel, Nirdai, Timid, Darpok, Insipid, Rasheen, Arrogant, Hati, Proud, Garb, Sarcastic, Vyangpurn ya Nindapurn, complacent be prava, miserable means dukhit, lonely means akela, unforgiving means maaf, vain means virth, thoughtless means vicharhin ya alhar ya be prava. In this way, you have to arrange this given group of words respectively in positive and negative waves must note it down 
and get checked so that you can use all these words in sentences properly